Hi, everybody. We'll rejoin you with Grace. 80 mile an hour winds down here in the Caribbean Sea. No threat, no problem. It went through the Cayman Islands there and uh, caused some problems today, but it's moving to the west at 18 miles an hour. It's going to cover 400 miles between now and this time tomorrow and be over the Yucatan and then back over the southwestern Gulf. It'll weaken slightly and then regenerate into a hurricane going in between Tampico and Veracruz on a Friday night. Way to the south and no problem for us whatsoever because of this area of high pressure that's steering it off to the west and eventually west-southwest and so that uh, puts the kibosh on any uh, meaningful rainfall for us as we're only going to see isolated showers. You can see the moisture tracker here. It goes away. It's dry tomorrow and uh, then a little bit of moisture here on Friday. So isolated showers Friday and again on Saturday, isolated showers mainly south of Corpus Christi, and then it really dries out then as we uh, move through the weekend. So here's what it looks like on the future clouds and rain. Not much at all tomorrow. On Friday, again, we'll pick up a isolated shower in the region. The lows tonight, 81 degrees here. The highs tomorrow look like this, and we'll see 96 but a heat index that hits 115 here tomorrow afternoon. So watch out for that. The seven day forecast again, isolated showers Friday and Saturday. It should say breezy, sweltering heat and uh, temperatures reach back into the mid to upper 90s here Sunday through Wednesday of next week. Pat.